You're watching Popular Cruising, and a review of the dining on board the Star Princess from Princess Cruises. As life is uncertain, let's start with dessert first. Or if nothing else, the International Cafe, which is open 24 hours in the ship's piazza. Where they've even mastered the newly famed Cronut. A complimentary goodie that can be ordered with a specialty coffee. Or any number of drinks from the adjacent lobby bar. And across the piazza is the Vines Bar, where tapas and sushi are served with any beverage purchase. And next door at the Vine Shop, you can purchase your favorite wine or some chocolates to take home. Capri is one of three main dining rooms that serves up a more intimate experience and tasty appetizers like this crab meat quiche. The Portofino Dining Room is another Italian-inspired venue, where pasta favorites like fettuccine alfredo are prepared. The last of the three, and also featuring lovely murals, is the Amalfi Dining Room, with entrees such as succulent shrimp Danielle. As for some of the watering holes on board, Shooters acts as the sports bar, and unfortunately, the smoking lounge on board as well. For cleaner air and live music, there's the classy Crooners Bar. And for maritime aficionados, the Wheelhouse Bar offers a nostalgic space complete with ship paintings and models. And it serves as a nice quiet nook during the day. For specialty dining, the Metropolitan Crown Grill is the onboard steakhouse, which on sea days is the location for a pub lunch, with timeless standards like fish and chips and bread and butter pudding. Come dinner time, creative dishes like lamb carpaccio are served, as well as refreshing tiger prawns and papaya. And entrees include a hearty portion of surf and turf, before finishing with a chocolate fudge obsession. And Sabatini's is the ship's excellent specialty Italian restaurant, serving homemade focaccia breadsticks with olive oil and vinegar, along with a mouth-watering sample of prosciutto ham. Unique appetizers include a chilled veal roast with tuna and caper aioli, and a flavorful marinated shrimp salad. And the short rib daily pasta selection was great, as was the lobster prepared three ways, and the white chocolate mousse with limoncello cream. In what can best be described as a cul-de-sac of food, the buffet always had a great selection, from entrees to dessert, which was always wonderfully displayed. While we didn't have a chance to try it ourselves, here's where you'll also find the Crab Shack for another alternative dining experience. And there's no shortage of bars serving the Lido and Pool Decks, the Outrigger Bar and Calypso Bar included, the Oasis Bar covers the stern, and the Midship Pool Area is covered by the Tradewinds Bar, as well as the Mermaid's Tail Bar. But most noteworthy at the pool is Movies Under the Stars, and the complimentary snacks of popcorn, cookies, and milk. Or more substantially from the Prego Pizzeria are some of the best pizza pies on the high seas, which for a small fee can even be delivered to your stateroom. Also at the pool is where you'll find tasty grill items. And since we started with dessert, ice cream as well to finish. Thanks for watching. Please feel free to follow these links to our other Star Princess videos, subscribe to our channel, and visit popularcruising.com.